A U.S. veteran, his wife, and his good friend embarked on a 200-mile walking journey from Bemidji to St. Cloud to raise money and awareness for the Wounded Warrior Project. Reporter Sherelle Moore takes us to where it all began this morning at Paul and Babe. This will be my legacy. I, I just can't see me doing this again at my age. 60-year-old U.S. Air Force veteran Jerry Meadows has been planning his 215-mile walk from Bemidji to St. Cloud for months. It won't be easy for him. He uses an oxygen tank, and he's had 10 cardiac stents. But he says it's all worth it to raise money for the Wounded Warrior Project. I don't feel that they've got the credit that they've needed. Uh, unlike the VA, and I'm not knocking them, but the Wounded Warriors Project also facilitate programs for family members. Meadows' friend, Ricky Wietzma, volunteered to walk beside him, while Meadows' wife, Virginia Miller, follows behind in a truck marked with lights and an American flag. I worry about his heart and the weather, and then I'll be so glad when he comes to the end of the line and gets it finished so we can get home and get him rested back up. They estimate the walk will take around 30 days. The group says no matter what they face along the way, the journey will be worth it. That uh, great feeling of achieve, achieving this goal that we've set. Even if you can't afford a dollar, just honk. You can't believe the motivation that that gives people who are out there. Reporting about Bemidji, Sheryl Moore, Lakeland News. The group's goal is to raise about $10,000. We have a donation information posted on our website along with this story at lptv.org slash news. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.